Evaluate the following if x is a real number that is not equal to 0. So we have the absolute value of x divided by x. So in order to do this, we need to know the definition of absolute value. So the absolute value of x is equal to x, and this will be true if x is greater than or equal to 0. And the absolute value of x is equal to minus x, or the opposite of x, or negative x, if x is less than 0. So in this problem, we're actually going to get two answers. Let's do each one individually. So if x is greater than or equal to 0, then the top piece, the absolute value of x, is going to become x. So we get x over x, so it's equal to 1. If x is less than 0, then the absolute value of x is going to be equal to negative x. So we'll get negative x over x, so we get negative 1. So we have two possible answers. So if we want, we can write this as a nice piecewise function. So we put an equal sign, and we put these fancy brackets, and we know that it's equal to 1 if x is greater than or equal to 0. And it's equal to negative 1 if x is less than 0. I hope this video has been helpful.